Hello and welcome to Wild Tribe. My name is Belinda. Today, under the theme of survival, we will learn how to make a simple tarpaulin stretcher. The decision to move someone who is hurt is always a last resort, as it's best to wait for emergency first aid help to come, particularly if the person might have injured their neck or their spine. However, if you must move someone because perhaps they're in danger from a burning building or woodland, or perhaps they're next to a rising river or the tide is coming in, then you must make sure that you make a sturdy, safe stretcher that is easy to carry to help the casualty quickly to safety. So, you will need to go and find yourself two long, rigid, strong poles, preferably longer than your casualty is going to be on the stretcher and also you'll find yourself a tarpaulin or a large blanket so you're going to spread the tarpaulin out like that and taking one of your long poles you're going to place it thirds from one of the ends. Fold the tarpaulin over on top of the hole. Take the second hole and lay it down with a little bit of an overlap. Then take the remainder of the tarpaulin over the top, like so. Okay, don't worry about tying the tarpaulins in place because the weight of the casualty will actually hold them together. So, let's try it out. Ouch, ouch. So there you have it, our simple tarp stretcher. And if you have to carry someone a long way, sing. Singing helps us to remain calm in a challenging situation and leads to better decision making and problem solving. So I challenge you to make a stretcher and sing a song to help you walk and keep your spirits strong. I thought I heard the old man say, John Kanakanak to Rye. Thank you for listening today. Stay safe. Goodbye.